Damn. Versus three whispers stance has upgraded. Plus 30 dodge. Okay, what was uh, the difference between dodge and parry? Dodge was depends against range attacks from bows, javelins, and magic spells. Higher skill ranks will reduce damage taken or even cause enemies to miss their attack altogether. Oh, okay. Oh, wow, she only has nine vitality? <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay, that's only plus one to... That's plus one to quickness. Okay. Yeah, she kind of needs more HP than uh, what we do. Peric over here is just like, I mean, after all, he is the damn tank, so. Uh, <laughs> Ooh. Hopefully, I didn't waste a lot of money on these. If I did, well, that sucks. Oh well. Huh? Only Ev can equip this? Oh. Huh. Let's go. Get out of here. Um, any new areas? No. So that means Have you made anything of late? Wow. Interesting. Anyways, I'd like to train. Oh, you don't have anything I want to train in. Anyways, uh, mind your tongue, I'm killed for less. Ugh. Anyways, silent. Well, let's see what's in stock. Uh, 
Uh, yep. Oh. Swordbreaker. Train. Eh. Um. How about you? Paper three, nice. Ooh, subterfuge, yes please. Go, 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 go. Oh, I maxed out on that. Did I level up though? You learn something every day. I did. I did. I did, chat. Um. Yeah, let's go with. Yeah, let's. Yeah, let's go with more might. And over here. Dark in the sky. Boom. Nice. Nice. Ooh, actually, I probably should have checked that. Oh, well. That's bonus 18. Huh. Well, anyways. Uh... Oh. Yeah. Okay. Boop. Boop. Yep. Definitely going for that. Then we're back to here. Uh, great increase weapon damage while dual wielding. Uh, I think that's the first one we go for. Uh, verse gains bonus graze position and graze deflection. When verse is defeated, the she immediately attacks all nearby enemies. Okay, well, we're going to go with this one first. Boom. Awesome. Here we are. Boom. Let's rest. Oh, wait. Hold on. Actually, now that I think about it. But never mind. Damn. I guess we need to go up to him. Or him. Oh, well, damn. Really?
rude. Huh. Well, that's pretty rude. That's twice now you've undone the Edict of Storms promised to be the death of the peninsula. I have no idea how the Unbroken lasted as long as they did. What with the blighted crops, obliterated roads... What is it you need? Okay, we have, al we have already ended up talking with her. We need to go there, huh? Oh, wow. Didn't realize that part. Interesting. Down here. Oh, that's two non. And what's over here? Oh, Spire. Oh, interesting. Oh. We only have one direction really to go now. Oh. Oh, I should have rested. Hold on. Oh, well. We exhausted it all. Edict of Fire. Plus 15 to all magic cells. Plus 5 control fire. Empowered Bane. Oh, uh, well. Speaking of fire skill, then. Uh, set that up to a hundred. Wow. Never mind. Jeez. Fine. I'll assign you... What do I not care about? I don't really care about... Carrying onwards. Resting. Good God. Oh, the range decreased though. accuracy though plus a little bit of extra dps but it's minus but it loses armor penetration so i'll set this here for now what are you uh 
magical accent which increased the accuracy of the spell. Oh, okay. Oh, there's a doe. As you approach, you see a stern-faced woman having a heated discussion with a frightened young man. She holds a piece of paper in her hand and punctuates every word, uh, every few words with a pointed tap on the sheet. The young man turns bright red and shakes two shuffling steps, uh, takes two shuffling steps backward, his eyes casting about for her help from the group, but no one gathered will, uh, gathered will meet his gaze. Finally, the woman throws the paper at him and says dismissively, we're done here. The young man uh, makes a couple of frantic uh, grabs of the paper before finally securing it, then turns and runs away. Tripping as he goes, the woman squeezes her eyes shut, uh, closed, sighs, and puts the palm of her hand against her forehead, working it around in small circles. She takes another deep breath, and then she turns to face you. Oh, we're at zero wrath. We're at three favor. Nice. She gives you a uh, she gives you a half bow, her face stoic and her voice flat. Fate finder. The last thing I expected here was a representative of the disfavored. My name is Renetta. We are not properly prepared to receive you as we have recently taken a prisoner and he has proven to be quite the handful. And I have the feeling you're probably here to speak of just such matters. What business do you have with the sage? I've come in search of someone named Merrick. I have learned that he may be here. Redna smiles and points south, uh, south toward a house with a sage and beastman standing in front. He's here, all right. He's our captive, and he isn't going anywhere. I'd like to talk to your prisoner. Uh, Renata folds her arms and looks at you incredulously. Well, considering he was probably sent to finish the job uh, the edict started, which would mean you're probably here to check up on him. Why ever would I let you do that? I just want to see him briefly, but uh, he might be more inclined to talk to me. Absolutely not. The last thing I need is you two colluding against me. Now, I'm I'm incredibly busy, and I have to do work, so leave me be. Why not just send someone with me to make sure that we're not colluding? We are, we are not criminals, Sage. Whatever else you might think, we are the ones that in the right here, and you are simply an obstruction to be moved aside by force if needed. Whoa, Beric. She scrutinized Beric with a mixed uh, expression. Easy for you to say when you stand as tall as the library stacks. <laughs> Come down to my level if you want to pick a fight, you great iron spire. <laughs> Bash has commanded me to speak with Merrick. You are standing in the way of Kairos' forces. And I have scattered a group to collect and lead. Everyone has hardships, and I really don't care to hear about yours. Kairos has done enough damage. I will not allow it to continue while I am here. You can bluster all you want. You will not be speaking to the prisoner. I won't ask you again, Renata. But let me talk to Merrick or pay the price. Oh, come on. Really? So be it. You'll find that sages aren't so easily silenced. Guards, we are under attack. Send me your champion! Just cast. Oh god, did I not did I cast the wrong spell? Probably. Anyways. Die, nah, you'll get the <laughs>
That ain't no fire spell. Immunity to frozen. Ah, okay. <laughs> well, that was a bit unfortunate. Anyways. I guess they're just gonna do it like this. What the hell is this? You have a wound now? Pretty sure uh, you're getting a wound. Oh no! Oh! Hot damn. Alright, listen, buddy. You need to get your thing off now. Why have. Oh. Probably because I casted something. Anyways. Okay, can't cast it. Anyways, uh, you better heal yourself up. Boop. Same as you. Ah. Far apart first. So, how about this? I'm not in time. Oh, okay. They are slightly too far apart. Slightly unfair. That was slightly not cool. The game literally just said, hey, uh, buddy, yeah, no. This is a forced option. Damn it. Damn it, game. I had three favor with them. Now I have, like, none, I'm pretty sure. Oh, yeah. Now I gain a lot of. Rude. Finally learned some stone. How I, oh, this is it. Oh, that's uh, okay. Interrupt a lot, a lot of interrupt. That's that's really it, though. Oh, line. Anyways, uh, let's just set that. I need you. I need you to do this. Oh, that's a cone. Oh God, I don't want the cone.
Okay. Boom. But yeah, hey, we finally have stone though. I suppose. Flesh to stone. Why the hell do we don't have that? Why the hell do we not have that? I can give this to Barrack. Definitely need to get some accuracy. Yeah. Oh, right. I guess that's going in here. There we go. Boop. But that was that was actually really kind of unfortunate. The game just said, "Hey, I'm not going to be new on option for this one. I don't care how much favor we have. We have three. We had three damn favor for them. Game." That was rude. Well, let's, well, well, let's carry on. Lantry, couldn't you have talked to them at all? That would have been great. What do you want? I've already faced enough torments at the hands of these scholars. You're Tudon's fate finder, aren't you? I'd recognize you anywhere. But I'm afraid you have me at a disadvantage right now. I am at your mercy. Oh, before I forget Ash's orders, you're a weakling and don't deserve to live. <laughs> we could start betraying the Alliance, but what does that give us? Uh, you must be Merrick. Ash has tasked me with destroying the library, so I need your help to get past the chorus. Uh, Merrick looks dismayed, so Graven Ash sent someone to finish what I couldn't do. I knew I had failed my mission, but I didn't know I was going to be given a chance to redeem myself. So be it. There's no point in mourning what I cannot change. As for your opinion, I wish I could help you, Fate of Honor, but at present, I can't even help myself. What happened to you? Well, he's tied up, obviously. My scouts and I were uh, infiltrated by the burning library. Uh, one of my best, Jelena... Oh, my scouts and I were infiltrating the burning library. Read that really wrong. One of my best. Jelena must have been working with a scholar chorus. She disappeared, and shortly after, we were hunted down. She used her oath found connection against us. That's how the chorus was able to pin down our location. Damn clever. I know... I don't know how many of us were taken, but these sages caught me while I was resting. Suppose I should feel grateful. Now I just await my execution, unless you're willing to help me. Well, set me free and we can talk some more. Uh, talk more. Uh, that would be a real favor, and if we were worried about the muscle around camp, the rest of my scouts are nearby. They can help us fight off the sage scum. Why couldn't they? Oh, yeah, never mind. Well, the sage is already dead. You're free. Anyways, Merrick has been joined by members of his unit. Two weary-looking oath-bound with large patches of ash and blood uh, blanketed their armor. They nod to their commander as they approach, a curiously nonchalant reaction to his rescue. Merrick appears to regain some strength at the sight of his men. He beckons vigorously as you approach, a determined expression visible on his face. Thank you for your help, Feybinder. I will forever be in debt to you. 
for helping me to avoid the shame of dishonorable death on top of my other failure. I am afraid I must ask for ask more of you, even after you have already done more for me than I can repay. First, you will help me. I need to get to the library. I will tell you everything I know. I only ask you do something for me once you make it to the library. Graven Ash tasked me and my group with destroying it. Unfortunately, we were discovered and routed, but I know how to get you there safely. Here, let me mark on your map how to bypass all the course patrols to get to the library. Once there, you need only deal with the sensor to get inside. Okay. Be aware, Fate Divine. One of my soldiers mentioned a large magical barricade deep inside the library. The sensor has her gang searching the entire building for parts of some kind of passcode to get beyond it. If you're going to accomplish your goal, you will need to find the passcode before they do. I wish I had more information for you, but I hope that that will help you. Now, I would make my request of you. Can you tell me about the e can you tell me anything about the edict? Unfortunately, not. Burning library entrance is now unlocked on the world map. Oh, yay! Yes. Got it. Uh all I know is that the forbidden lore in the library must be destroyed. The Graven Ash believes that destroying the silent archive will achieve this, but with the barrier protecting it, no one can get to it. At least, it seems no one has gotten in yet. Otherwise, the edict would have ended. What is your request? Some of my oath-bound scouts are still missing. Two are in the burning library, and that third, Jelena, is in the Scarlet Corps' camp. I want to see her properly punished for her betrayal as much as I want to see the others saved. Tell me about this betrayal. Well, she used her oath-bound connection against us. That's how the course were able to... Oh, okay, sure. You already told us that. You mentioned the oath-bound connection. What is that? Uh, because you helped me, I will tell you. But normally this knowledge is not shared outside the disfavored. Before you are truly an uh, before you're truly an oath bound, you must complete a ritual that connects you to each one of uh, each one of your brothers. Their feelings become yours. Their pains are your pains, and their troubles are yours as well. Atlanta used the act connection to betray us. She must be made to pay for that act. What do you want me to do? I ask of you to find my missing men and return them to me. Jelena must be made to pay for her crimes, and I will not have another any of other, have another of my men lost to her weak will. You're lucky. I have business there as well. I will look for your oath bound. Wrath. Why did they give me wrath? Eh, well, anyways. I would have failed in my mission. Your name will be praised as long as I can draw breath. I will await your return here. Why did they give me wrath? Maybe because of how nonchalantly I said it? Eh, well, anyways. My Lord Binder, what can I do for you? At your service, Fate Binder. What do you need? Hmm. Anyways, I think this is actually going to be a good time to stop because I need to go home. <laughs> I am home. Why did I say that? I need to go to bed. <laughs> also, I need to finish. I also, I need to get those videos done. So thank you guys for coming out to the stream. Hope you had yourselves a fantastic time. So I got to get out of here, guys. We will pick this up tomorrow at 7 p.m. Reminder, it's going to be the, uh, this is going, that tomorrow is the last stream for the week. And then on Sunday, Sunday, it's going to be the start of our Horizon Zero Dawn run. <laughs> I can't wait.